So when I realized that, I was like, okay, 2015, I turned 30. It's going to be my year of do it anyway. Anything that scares me, I'm going to actively pursue it. So I'm a Capricorn. I like my feet solidly on the ground. I decided to take my first ever solo vacation, and it was out of the country to the Dominican Republic. So on my birthday, what did I do? I went zip lining through the forest of Punta Cana, and for some odd reason, I had on business casual. Don't ask why. <laughs> And I had an incredible time. Also, I don't like being submerged in water. I like to be again on solid ground. So I went to Mexico and swam with dolphins underwater. And then the cool thing that I did also that year that was my mountain was I wrote my book. I'm judging you the Do Better Manual, and I had to own that whole writing thing now, right? Yes. But. The very anti-me thing that I did that year that scared the crap out of me. I went skydiving. We were about to fall out the plane. I was like, I've done some stupid things in life. This is one of them. <laughs> and then we come falling down to earth, and I literally lose my breath as I see earth. And I was like, I just fell out of a perfectly good plane on purpose. <laughs> What is wrong with me? But then I looked down at the beauty, and I was like, this is the best thing I could have done. This is an amazing decision, and I think about the times when I have to speak truth. It feels like I am falling out that plane. It feels like that moment when I'm at the edge of the plane, and I'm like, "You shouldn't do this," but then I do it anyway because I realize I have to. Sitting at the edge of that plane and kind of staying on that plane is comfort to me, and I feel like every day that I'm speaking truth against institutions and people who are bigger than me and. And just forces that are more powerful than me, I feel like I'm falling out of that plane. But I realize comfort is overrated, because being quiet is comfortable. Keeping things the way they've been is comfortable, and all comfort has done is maintain the status quo. So we've got to get comfortable with being uncomfortable by speaking these hard truths when they're necessary. And I. And for me, though, I realize that I have to speak these truths. Because honesty is so important to me, my integrity is something I hold dear. Justice—I don't think justice should be an option. We should always have justice. Also, I believe in shea butter as a core value. And. <laughs> <laughs>